played quite a ill-tempered game at times this afternoon. What was it like to play in? Uh, I don't mind games like that. Uh, I enjoy it. Fans getting on to you, players getting on to you, quite physical. There's the type of games that you want to play, in my opinion, especially as a defender. Um, you can't back down in them type of games. You know what team your is going to be, quite physical, in your face. But you stand up to them and you be in their face as well. And it's about who's, who's the best man on the day. And that's, that's the type of games that I enjoy playing in. You almost have to stand up to the players and the crowd. They seem to give you a bit of stick. But when that happens, do you sort of puff your chest out and think, OK, then I'll show you? Uh, to be fair, I, I didn't notice the, the fans booing me until like the last 10 minutes of the game. <laughs> I was thinking, I, I don't know what I've done here, but <laughs> you're just making me want to play better. So you might as well just keep booing me. I, I don't mind it. Um, I don't know what I've done, but that's, that's not my business. You can boo me, you can cheer me. I still play the exact same way. It has nothing to do with my... It won't affect my performance at all. Um, obviously, you have the players in and around you, and you know what you're going to get from your over in your face, in your ear. But look, I, I think the boys put in a great shift today, and I think the, the boys were quite physical, and we stood up to them and done our job. We had to come back twice in, in, in the game this afternoon from behind, but did you think we probably did enough to, to go and win it by the end? I think we were unfortunate not to win it. Um, quite frustrating, especially in the change room. We, had a, we all know that we had a few chances in the game. And it's unfortunate on another day that I might go on the back of the net. Um, you see their second goal, ricochets, ricochets, ends up as a goal. Gavin's chance is a ricochet, ricochet, and unfortunately it doesn't even end up in the back of the net. But look, at the end of the day, the luck wasn't with us there. But even to get a point away against Yeovo, I think that's still great. Still unfortunate, we're not, still, we're not happy because we should have got the three points, but we'll still take a point. Talk us through your goal. We were only behind, I think, four minutes, and then you've ghosted in there and really met it well with your head, didn't you? Look, I, I get onto the gaffer and I get onto Sweeney's always saying, put me in the box for, for the right. free kicks. You get, like, I, I want to attack it and I, uh, I back myself, header in. And at the end of the day, um, Ryan put in, put in a great ball. I saw it coming and lost my man and jumped up. The rest was history, put in the back of the net. But, you know, uh, yeah, it was, it was a good feeling to score and to help the team. And Gus's header was amazing as well. So. I was going to say, is Gus trying to say that his header was better than yours? We've had a few arguments in the change room. I, I'm, I'm saying to Gus, I've put mine in the corner. You know, you know what I mean? Like, it's coming towards me and I send it back that way. Gus has put his in the corner as well. But no, like, um, I think uh, Gus, the ball, like, I think some people won't notice and they won't remember, but Featherston's ball for Gus for, the, like, for that second goal was outstanding, in my opinion. For him to put in that area, then obviously the rest was up to Gus. Gus sent it back and it was an amazing header. And, and, you know, even though we're disappointed, I suppose that tells us how well we've played against the side who was second in the league going into this. No, nah, yeah, definitely. Um, it's, it's a hard one to take, uh, knowing that we could, we should have, in my opinion, got three points. We still played well, in my opinion. We played well the first half, played well the second half. Even when we were behind, we were still playing well. But it's just little things that we were, little mistakes that we were doing that cost us the three points, in my opinion. But we know what we need to do to work on and we, like, we know what we need to do moving on to help us.